Hey there and welcome back to my channel all to do with blogging. Today we're diving deep into the world of low fruit keyword research. Low fruit keywords are search terms that have a relatively lower competition and higher search content. Low fruit keywords offer several benefits that will honestly supercharge your SEO. Firstly, they have less competition, which means you have a way better chance of ranking for those specific keywords, meaning you're going to have a higher chance on getting on that page one of Google, my friends. One of the most powerful tools that you can use right now to perform brilliant low fruit keyword research is actually lowfruit.io. Now, lowfruit have got it set up so you can actually sign up for free and actually use the tool initially for free. This is awesome because you can just go right now, type in whatever topic it is you are specifically writing about, and it will serve you with a load of low fruit keywords. This is perfect for you being able to tailor your keyword research to figure out what articles you should be covering. At the end of the day, is there any point in rewriting what is already on the internet? Why don't you select an article which has less attention to it, meaning you've got a higher chance of getting on that page one and making the money, baby. <laughs> okay, so this is lowfruits.io, and I'm working in partnership with them today for this video. Now, I'll be honest, they didn't reach out to me. I reached out to Low Fruits in order to create this partnership. And the reason for that is I've been using Low Fruits for a little while now. And it got to the point where I was using it so much for all five of my websites that I was like, you know what? I really just want to do some sort of collaboration and share what I'm learning with my audience. So I reached out to them and they were kind enough to consider a collaboration. So thanks for that, Low Fruits. I appreciate that. So first is first, let's go to Keyword Finder. They use Google Autocomplete Extractor tool to actually find these. So let's type in what we're looking for. In this instance, I don't want this to go to waste. So I'm going to specifically search for something that's in relation to one of my websites. Now, I don't always talk about what websites because I don't really want my websites to get copied. But the one that I am going to show you today is one that I'm going to look at selling in the future. So I don't mind that one too much being known. This is World of Warcraft. It's Battleshout.com. And this is all about World of Warcraft as a game and any gaming gear that you might need in order to play World of Warcraft. I need more topics for this in specific. So I'll open up my blogging sheet. And as you can see here, uh, I've got all my silo planned out and everything like that. I want to put more topics in here that are in relation to these specific topics here. So let's look at leveling guides, World of Warcraft guides, leveling guides. Okay, so if I typed in World of Warcraft leveling, and then I set the country to United States, I can specifically find keywords that are going to be in relation to World of Warcraft leveling, which is going to be great for me. So let's find some keywords. Oh, fantastic. So it's actually gone ahead and it's generated a load of keywords. 154 keyword ideas have been found related to World of Warcraft leveling. To access these, we can literally just click access or we can go ahead and analyze this. 48 credits will be used. I'm going to do it. Let's do it. Yes, I want to analyze real time keyword analysis. So we're just waiting for this to finish. Great. So it's actually analyzed it and said 27% opportunities. So let's view the report. Oh, so this is actually what it's telling us here. Weak spots. World of Warcraft leveling 2023. Wow, this is brilliant. And it's telling us the specific words uh, that we can go for. And this is who's our competition. We've got Rested XP. Uh, neural gamer. Oh, wow. Fantastic. So we've actually got some really good competition that we could actually get some nice little spots here. Wowzers. So we can actually really benefit from creating an article here around this specific subject. So I would take this keyword here. And as you can see, when you click this, it actually shows you who your competition is, what their domain authority is, what they're potentially lacking on and who you can potentially beat. So see these green markers here. These are potential people that you could actually edge out of in terms of competition and perform better. So that's a winner winner chicken dinner situation. So I would definitely take that keyword there and put it in my spreadsheet, which I will actually do. 
But the brilliant thing is with low fruits, you don't just have to copy and paste and all that. You can just export it right here. Export all keywords and it will actually and it will actually prepare the export for you that you can download. Then you can just download it and it's put everything into a spreadsheet for you to check out later on down the line. Now, what I potentially love doing in this situation is taking this spreadsheet and actually just putting all the data in to chat GPT. So what you can do is just copy and paste the relevant information. So basically just copy and paste all this potential information. There's honestly so much here in terms of information that we can just copy it. We then go to chat GPT and we say, analyze this info and tell me what topics I should write articles about first and then paste the information below. Brilliant. So chat GPT has actually analyzed this information almost instantly and then told us what we can actually produce articles about, which is insane. This is really, really good content here. And we can actually just take each of these potential keywords and add them to our spreadsheet. At the end of the day, why would you spend hours and hours trying to analyze spreadsheets when you've got a tool here called ChatGPT, which can do it for you? So fantastic. So we managed to get some really good little keywords here for us to use in terms of World of Warcraft leveling. Let's look at something else instead now. Let's try something else. So let's go to Keyword Finder and let's look up something else World of Warcraft related. So the most recent expansion to World of Warcraft is Dragonflight. And I want to find some really good niche topics within Dragonflight that I can get some keyword research done for. So let's do that right now. Wow. So World of Warcraft acronym. Wow. Dragonflight. And then that's all I want to put because I want to know what people are searching a lot of at the moment and get some good information on that. Now, I will say. Dragonflight is a very broad topic within World of Warcraft. So I'm hoping that this will be able to guide us in a way that will help us find some really good opportunities. So let's do that right now. Find keywords. Wowzers, that's found a lot of keywords. I did say that this was a broad topic. So we would need to be kind of careful here with analyzing all of these, because in all honesty, that's going to use like 652 credits in one go. I don't necessarily want to do that. If I did, that would be fine to do that, but you would have to bear in mind you're going to lose a lot of your credits in order to do that. So I would actually try and find a more specific topic within World of Warcraft Dragonflight. OK, great. So I've just found a keyword here called WoW Dragonflight Snail Mount. This is really, really good because we have a section here for Mount and we are looking for uh, for edging our competition out. So having a long tail keywords such as wow dragonflight snail mount is actually going to be really really good for us so i'm going to go ahead and add that to my list of words we should actually write about now i don't want to analyze personally using their tool because i don't want to waste all my credits but what i will just do is look through at the search volume and see what potentially i can actually find so wow dragonflight mythic plus item level could be a really good one to write about however i also know that this is extremely competitive to write about. So I'm actually going to stay away from that because my competition have such high levels of authority in this topic space because they are databases. It's going to be extremely hard for just a normal blogging site to compete with a database type blog. This is a fantastic keyword. Wow, Dragonfly Twitch drops. That's a great word that we can use. And we could probably stick that in World of Warcraft guides while in game events. So we can take that. Fantastic keyword. I really love that one. That's one that I really want to see written about soon. So I'm going to get my writers on that. Just scanning through here, looking for any ones that really strike me as ones that could do really well. Okay. I really like this one. Dragon Slayer title. Wow. That seems like a, it could be a really good one for us to write about. So we'll probably stick that in wow tips as it doesn't really fall under any specific area. So we'll actually stick that in the Dragon Slayer title. Wow. Oh, this is a really good one. Wow, Dragonflight Alt Leveling. We can actually stick that in our leveling section. And already we're, we're coming up with loads and loads of keywords here for our blog. With such little effort, this has pretty much found a load of keywords that I'm able just to pull down into my spreadsheet. And my writers can just go hammering straight to work, getting all these wonderful blog posts written for my site, which will hopefully 
boost up the rankings and get us search on Google. Now this site in particular is already getting nearly a thousand hits per day. So we just want to bump that up even more. So when we do come to eventually sell it, it will sell for a better price. I want to search up another keyword now, and I want to look up what gaming gear people use for World of Warcraft and specifically what they're searching for. So let's look for, I'm going to search for World of Warcraft PC and just see what comes up from World of Warcraft PC. This is because I really want to write about more topics that are in relation to affiliate products to do with gaming PCs, gaming laptops, gaming accessories, hardware reviews, things of this nature. If we can start to rank for those types of keywords, we could do really well in the future. So before I click analyze, I'm actually just going to check the access and just see because I can always analyze this later on. OK, so immediately I can see that not a lot of people are searching specific, you know, PC requirements that th these are a lot more technical queries. So it's probably not going to be the best for me to look into this one too much. PC gamer port. No portable port. No, 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 no. Let's try again. I'm going to try World of Warcraft hardware gaming and see what happens there. OK, so it says this specific keyword research is too narrow. That's fine. So let's open it up a bit more. Ooh, so I typed in best PC for WoW and we actually got some really good keywords found. So let's analyze these so that we can find the best potential words to write about. OK, so there's 84 opportunities here, 84 percent opportunities. This is fantastic. So let's go ahead and click that. Wowzers, there is some incredible opportunity here. Best PC monitor for WoW. Best computer monitor for WoW. Best budget PC for World of Warcraft. Best. Oh my gosh, look at those. And these are fantastic. We can definitely, definitely create some really good articles around this content. This is basically just planned out all my future content, just like that. So we can go ahead and create some really fantastic articles around this with some amazing affiliate links. And hopefully, our website will do that much better. Last but not least, Using these keywords from lowfruits.io is so valuable to your website, but it's more valuable for you to actually track how your articles perform when you use these. Using SEO plugins like Rank Math can really, really help you tailor your articles to make sure you've got enough SEO in your articles. For months, I was writing articles when I started without really knowing if I was using enough SEO within my articles, when I changed and added the free plugin Rank Math to my blog post, it absolutely changed the way that myself and my writers write posts on all of the websites I work on. Using something like Rank Math in conjunction with lowfruits.io is a perfect way to get awesome keyword research done. And remember, guys, we can just do keyword research once and then not need to touch it again for months at a time until you've finished all your articles. That's a winner winner chicken dinner situation if you're asking me. And there you have it, my dearest friends. That is my comprehensive guide on keyword research using low fruits. I really hope that this video helped you. If it did, consider hitting that like button, consider clicking subscribe, and I'll see you in the next wonderful blogging video. This is Theo Ramwell. Have a lovely day.